oceans, and uh, we would take advantage of that. So. Yeah. Because I love me some prime rib. And I think Elisa, what do you think? I'm getting chip? the fish and chip. So here's the regular menu that you can get anytime. So I know we're going to be back to get Jason some chicken wings. And I'm sure we'll try the nachos and the shepherd's pie. We're probably going to try everything, but tonight I'm going for the fish and chips. Oh, they got a classic cheeseburger too. This is what Jason wants. This is what Jason's ordered. Tonight's special prime rib. Oh, the food has arrived. There's my fish and chips. And Jason's prime, prime rib. Prime turn rib. that turn that around so I can see it. Oh, that's a beautiful piece of meat now, isn't it? And it comes with corn and potato. Mmm. I do want to add that everything at Oceans is included. So you can come and you can order anything you want off the menu, and there's no charge for this. So that prime rib that Jason's got that he's cutting into is completely included. How is it? Awesome. It's so bloody. You like raw meat, don't you? It's not raw. <laughs> Some uh, tartar sauce there. Yeah, it's flaky fish. Mm. Nothing super special or fancy, just good old straightforward fish and chips, right? It's really good. Man. Good. It's really good. Right. Mmm, those look better than yesterday's wings. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Don't shake it, don't shake it. Yes! Still eating wings too, huh? <laughs> <coughs> How are they? Good? Now, do you like the jerk or the original better? I find the jerk. You like the jerk better? I figured those look better. They actually do look better than the others, so I figured you would like them better. Well, yeah, that first round I got a bunch of baby little wings. Oh, okay. And they turned your fingers red. These look a little pressure, yeah. There's my cheeseburger. Mm. Oh, it looks good. Deja vu. So this burger is great. The bread is what makes it. It's a really, really soft bun. And it's real buttery. Oh my. It's a thick, thick meat patty, y'all. I mean, it's about as thick as your thumb. Oh yeah, it's very thick. Can't beat it, huh? Good little burger. I'm almost happy with that. <laughs> okay, so we are in Oceans for our second breakfast. And here's the breakfast menu. Good morning. Good. Mm. This would make with the coffee for you. Yeah, I'll take a cup of coffee. First up is pastries. Which one'd you get? I have no idea what this is. This one looks good. Yeah. They all look good. Can't really go wrong with those. The strawberry filling and chocolate. Wow, yeah, really? Yeah, the little dark spots, that's chocolate. Yeah, you get a whole basket here. 
Alisa showed you. So this is the express breakfast. It's scrambled eggs, bacon, and hash browns. And Jason, you've got the country breakfast. I, uh, I got the uh, over easy eggs. Sausage, bacon. A little bit of mushroom, a little bit of grilled tomato, a couple of hash browns, two sausages, two pieces of bacon, and a little bitty ramekin of beans. Ooh, that's a big meal. It is. Yeah. Oh, and we got toast and butter and jam. Oh my gosh. Mmm. <laughs> Move things around, huh? Are the eggs cooked like you like them? Yep. Over easy. Do they have French onion soup, Jason? Yeah, but I'm just gonna get the grilled New York strip steak. Hey, Zini. And pepper crusted roast beef looks good. Thinly sliced roast beef. Yeah. With demi glaze sauce, sun dried tomato polenta, and sauteed soup. There's a lot of things that look good. The Parmesan crusted pork chop does too. And we have wine recommendations. Okay, so this is the Mediterranean grilled vegetable salad. And got the cob. Jason got the cob. It's got some uh, some eggs and tomatoes, chicken and bacon and avocado and some uh, spinach mix. Looks good. Give that a try. Bon a little bit of avocado, a little bit of chicken and a little bit of tomato. I just wanted to point out, see there's live music in here. Let me zoom in on this. That's why we wanted to eat in the Manhattan Room tonight, is for the live music. And you got the what salad? It's the Mediterranean Grilled Vegetables. It's a little eggplant, a little zucchini, a little arugula. It's a salad. But it's a good salad. Very refreshing. Yeah, it is refreshing. They're, the salads are good here. And they are. Yeah. So here is the Parmesan crusted pork chop. Jason I got Brady. the New York strip steak with peppercorn sauce. Ooh, horseradish. Please, please, please. Yeah. Absolutely. Thank you. Oh, Jason likes his horseradish. Thank you. Oh, yeah. So I asked for medium rare. Oh my god. Medium, medium rare. rare. Right, so we're off to a good start. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. <laughs> supposed to say that. moist people hate it's that not word dry. people hate the word moist but you know meat is dry this is not dry okay that'll work it's good. <laughs> it's very good. oh my gosh look at these desserts oh look at the cake the american cake I'm gonna get some of this. Mm, I found the pizza and the chocolate pecan tart. Oh yeah, that's got my name all over it. So what's your view of the buffet food? Well, the only thing I've had so far <laughs> is the Asian food. It's good. It's good. Really? Yeah, you gave me a bite, so I had to go get me, me some too. Yeah. Just to good. try it. Um, I had one piece of my pizza and I'm gonna eat the other. That's good pizza. It's not like the best pizza on the face of the earth, but it's good pizza. Now, what I've been waiting for is dessert. What you got? 
I got a chocolate pecan tart. <laughs> Baby's heavy. Okay. What is this? I don't know. I think it's like a decorative piece of chocolate. Hopefully it's got this little, let's see. It's like apricot. Yeah. Mm. Some kind of jelly. Are you getting more food? Um, we have Indian food. Chicken curry. All right. Try some more, honey. Try some more. Oh, that bread. Yum. Tortilla. Mm. So we got the chicken curry. We're just trying things tonight. We got this little sauce. I didn't get the name of the sauce. That was mango chutney. Mango chutney. And we got a little bit of the aligobi. Is that what it's called? I have no idea. And we got a little bit of that, that white sauce. I'm That's like back. a yogurt. We'll, we'll go back and get the names of the sauces. We're just gonna wrap it up in this bread. Mm. Gonna make it Indian taco? Yeah. <laughs> See how this comes out. See how this comes out. No promises, folks. This may not end good. <laughs> Mmm. Mm. Jason says, mmm. Good on the magnificent seafood buffet. We first have conch fritters. Okay. Gotta try one of those. Oh no, they just ran out of grilled shrimp. No. That's what I was gonna get. We're working on them now. Okay, fried yeah, fish. Right up here. Look, look. Yeah, this is fried fish. Get one of these. Sauteed vegetables next. Get me some of those. Oh, and you got the little tartar sauce on your fish. Okay, well we kind of want to wait for the shrimp, so let's just up. So we were patiently waiting for more grilled shrimp to come out. Oh, well worth the wait. That's okay. Yum. I'll grab you too. Yes. Yum. So we got shrimp and cucumber salad, seafood salad, Moroccan chickpea salad. That's interesting. We got Thai chicken and shrimp curry, New Orleans style seafood casserole. Look, we got boiled shrimp and shrimp cocktail salads. Oh, I like the meats and cheeses. I just like the meats and cheeses. Meats. And cheese. Mm. Oh, look at the beautiful. It's so pretty. So what all did you get, honey? Well, keeping it low carb. There's just so much more than this, what I got. But I'm uh, if you're a low carb person, you can appreciate this. Lots of good food. I got bold shrimp, grilled shrimp, grilled shrimp and vegetables, and then I got a vegetable medley with some mushrooms and some green peppers, and I got uh, an oyster, mm. and that's that's all I wanted. And I have the grilled shrimp. Hold on, focus. The grilled shrimp, a conch fritter, a fried fish with tartar sauce, some grilled vegetables, a little spoon of mashed potatoes, and then some meat and cheese and gar and pretzel bread. How's it tasting so far? You can't go wrong with boiled shrimp. How's the grilled shrimp? Try the grilled shrimp. They look amazing. These tail off. That's good. Awesome. Tastes like grilled shrimp to me. 
I can't complain with that. Nope. The salmon is wrapped in, but it's, it was the carving special, and it was salmon. I asked him, I said, what is it? He said, it's salmon. And he said, you need to pour the white sauce over it. I didn't get, catch what the kind of sauce it was. We're going to try it with this. So this is what it's it like looks a, it's like. It's like a breading or some sort? It's some sort of wrapped salmon. Wrapped salmon in a... In a, in a Oh wow. It's good. It's very good. Yeah, that's 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 nice. Good. Yeah, very nice. It's got look, I'll show you right here, it's got like this breading that's been wrapped around it. Uh-huh. So you want to cut a piece of this, alright, like that. It looks like pastry. And then you want to get a little bit of the sauce and a little bit of meat. And eat it all together. Good stuff. Very good. Awesome. Again, Fiesta lunch. And we have tacos and the dressings and quesadillas and nachos. Helps if you actually get some cheese. Mmm. So Jason's making him a taco salad. So salad stuff first, then you add the meat and cheese, huh? Oh yeah. So see, here's the pre-made tacos. It's just meat and cheese, or shell and meat. And then tortillas. I mean, that's uh, quesadillas. And then more ground beef, nachos, and nacho chips. So, Jason's idea of a taco salad. I've been drinking a little bit, got a little buzz, and I'm like loaded it on a little bit thicker than I should have. But I'll eat, I'll eat what I can. He got his meatballs. He's a happy man now. I'm gonna try some of this beef lasagna. Yeah, I played a little bit closer. Chicken parmesan. I want a meatball. Just one meatball. Ooh, that's always good. Nah. I just need a little bit. No. Oh, that's always yummy. Mm. Let's see what's around the corner. Salad. Oh. Look, it says Italian buffet. Mm, I don't know. The beef, slice of beef. Took a small slice, but then look, we got some gravy and this is horseradish sauce. That's good. Never had gnocchi before, sir. I don't know. I'm probably saying that wrong. Ooh, it's like a create your own pasta. That's kind of some lasagna, a meatball, some gnocchi, and some Italian bread. Jason, once again, did not get good carved beef. We're just striking out with the carved meats tonight. Yeah, the, carved, the carved beef and the buffet is dry as a bone. Trust me, folks, I don't just complain. No. This is not good. Bummer. Okay. Small. You're gonna get a small crate. What is uh what is blueberry? This one mango? Mango? This one pineapple? Oh, one. Yes. Strawberry. Nothing else? Some chocolate? A little cool, a little bit cool at the top. You know, plate. Oh, you got a little baby one. Thank you, sir. I got me a crepe. I actually got me one too. Mr. Diet Boy got him a crepe. Yes. I'm gonna let you try your bite first. Let's see if it's heaven like we think it is. 
Kevin, now I have strawberry and chocolate in mine. Yeah, I just have the strawberry. Oh. That's good, I know. I know, that's good. That's got that's hitting on all fronts. Oh my god. That's hitting. You're heading in the garden cafe for Asian night. Look at the decor. The Chinese lanterns. Look at this. Dragon. Oh my gosh. Asian night, baby. Wow. Okay, I'm not gonna get it tonight, but right. kimchi is amazing. So the buffet starts with kimchi. I love to take kimchi back at home and put it in ramen noodle soup. Ew. With boiled eggs and chopped pickles and onions. Ew, grady. That's no, good. Oh, look at look at look at look at the pen, the penguin made out of an eggplant. Ah, oh, look at that. <laughs> Cherry or grapes and carrots and carrots. wow, that's cool. That's really neat. All right, so kimchi, seafood salad. Oh, this looks good. Marinated Thai beef. Try a little bit of that. Roasted duck and glass noodle salad. Ooh, Interesting. Wow. Why not? Why not? Try a little bit of that. Shrimp and bro Szechuan shrimp and broccoli. Szechuan eggplant. Get a little bit of this. Grilled tilapia with Thai vegetables. Ooh, spicy Szechuan stir fried vegetables. Get a little bit of that. Okay, we got, ooh, vegetable lo mein. Love me some lo mein. Ugh, fried rice. Oh yeah, gotta have some fried rice. Sweet and sour pork. Why not? Mashed potatoes, that makes no sense. Okay. Spring rolls. Uh, I don't have any room for that, but yeah, there's some sweet chili sauce to go with. Okay, Jason, maybe a little spot for it. Carvings. That's crazy, and look, it says Asian buffet. Every night there's a new one. I love the decor in here. Look at all the Chinese lanterns hanging all the way down. Looks like we're going against the grain. Oh, Peking duck. Oh, we need to get down. Yeah, we need to go get in this this direction. Ooh, I'm like an Asian night. No joke. So this, this looks good. Duck. I got some kind of sauce, sweet sauce with it. Plum sauce. Plum sauce. This is uh, the dark meat, the leg quarter. We've never had Peking duck before. We're gonna try it. We're gonna split it together. I like skin, so we're gonna. Mm. Duck's good. Is it good? Yeah, ducks. I like duck. Cool. I do not like lamb. <laughs> no, you don't like lamb. Try it. Okay. So yeah, I got just a little bit of everything on this plate. So this is gonna be good to try. Asian. No Asian night is complete without chopsticks. Oh, the duck is good. Kind of tastes like chicken, huh? Yeah, it does. And yeah, I have some pork, some beef, Kung Pao chicken, some lao mein, some fried rice. Yeah. I mean, just a little bit of everything. I'm running, I'm running the gamut too. I got a yeah. little bit of everything. Can't go wrong with this meal. It's gonna be good. We like, we, we both like Asian food. Yeah. Into the garden cafe for some breakfast. Get some eggs. Oh, and that ham. I mean, I've gotten to where I'm eating the same thing every day for breakfast, but that's okay. Yeah, I mean, don't you just kind of eat eggs and sausage every day? Yeah. Mmm. Some fruit. Get a little bit of fruit. All right. First breakfast. <laughs> See if there's anything on this side. Yes, a little bit over here. Some cereal, milk. Oh, and oh, here we go on all this. Gosh. Apple, sticky, apple sticky buns. I know she's getting one of those. Well, yeah, I gotta make room on my plate. I want that one right in the middle. Super. Mm. Oh, yeah. oh my 
Lord Almighty. Oh yeah, that's evil right there. And, and that play. French, oh, mango French toast. That's it was apple French toast last way. time. Oh, here's some bacon. Yeah, yeah, and they've got that um, corned beef hash again, Jace. That stuff is incredible. I know you like that. And then... See if they got waffles today. Bread. I love the ham and the cheeses. Sometimes we get this. Drink station. Over here is the hot cereal. So you've got oatmeal, cream of wheat, and hot milk, cinnamon and sugar, and raisins. More cereal, more bread, pastries, and fruits. Got an Asian breakfast. Waffles? You gotta have a second plate for the waffles. Ooh. Okay, see that's that's a different plate though. It's like bananas foster, but they call it compote. All right, so we've got eggs, ham, hash brown, a little bit of fruit, an apple. What was that? Apple sticky bun. Uh huh. Jason made me a um, waffle with a uh, banana comp compote. Compote. And, and Jason's got Stan eggs. Good old Stanger. But I, I'm, and every kind of meat imaginable. Yeah, I'm gonna try the banga. This is the banga. The banga. <laughs> so I'm gonna try it. <laughs> I'm gonna bang out the banga. He's going to his English roots. I should have been English. Your ancestors are. Well, I just want banging awesome sausage man. It's good? Yeah. <laughs> I gotta give props to Norwegian on their eggs. Okay, a lot of times buffet eggs are either dry or they're runny. These are or fluffy. They're, or they're plastic. Or they're plastic. Yeah, or these fake. eggs are perfect. And we I've had them every morning for breakfast and they're always the same. They're nice consistent and, and they're so good. A little salt and pepper on them. Yeah. You're off to the races. Good. Yep. Very good breakfast. Okay, so we're heading into Moderno for lunch. They have what's called the Taste of Spain for lunch. So it's not the full, I'm not gonna try and pronounce it, where they shave the meat. That's not happening, but they do have a special lunch here. Okay, so here what we've got, this is called the Taste of Spain. So we've got salad on this side. Mushrooms. Yeah. Mm, mushrooms. Oh my God. This Marinated zucchini. Yeah, this is called a taste of Spain. So these are like tapas. These are like tapas. Let's go see what's on the other side. Looks like we got some soups here. Spanish style potato soup. Prosciutto. Oh yeah. This is. This is cool. And then we've got some desserts. Oh my, look at the salad. That looks fantastic. Oh yeah. Dessert. All right, yep, let's get us a plate. <laughs> Flan. Okay, so this is Spanish cuisine. So we've got, I made a salad, and then we've got all kinds of grilled squash and zucchini and eggplant and red peppers and green bell peppers and shrimp salad yeah, and corn these are like salad. Marinated red peppers marinated. Um, and they're like, they've been cooked down, they're really soft. Uh huh. How is that? Refreshing. Yes, this is a light lunch. I'm so excited to have found this. Yeah, this is a good find. This is, it's, a, it's light, but uh, it's going to be filling. Mm -hmm. It's refreshing. It's just a great, great switch up, change up. Yep. You know? And then there's, um, Spanish potato soup too, which has spinach. beans in it. Spinach and potato. Spinach and potato. Yeah, this looks good. All right, so Elisa's digging in. She's uh, making some pretty interesting facial expressions mm -hmm. over there. So they look actually good. Yeah. So the surprising thing is, I expected the vegetables to be hot, and they're not. They're cold. 
They're so flavorful. Oh. Okay, so this is a, um, a bell pepper, but it's marinated down. The seeds are taken out. Unbelievably good. Yeah. Mm. This was a great find. So good. So everything on the plate was cold. The soup is warm. And so it's potato soup, but there's no chunks of potato. It's like it's all been pureed. But there's um, there's spinach and then red beans in here. And it's very, very flavorful. It's good. Mm. You can take your bread and soak up that soup. And the bread like that. Ours was good. Lunch at Moderno. There's a little hidden gem. It's one of those things if you don't read your uh, freestyle guide, freestyle daily, to see what's going on and where to eat, you wouldn't have found this. Yeah, and it may not be for everybody, but uh, it was definitely for us. It was and light and refreshing and it was nice. Different, but in such a good way. You ought to try it. Okay, I've never in my life had flan, so I decided I must try this. What is flan? I have no idea. It's, an, it's a Spanish custard dessert. So Spanish this is dessert. This is flan, and that's an apple fritter. So let's. I'm thinking so creme brulee, it's like, but like a pudding almost yeah, consistency. It's a custard. It's a Latin okay. custard, yeah. I don't know what that's about. I don't know if I like it or not. <laughs> it's, it's I, I would bet no based on your no, pause. It's, it's just different. It's different. So you it's have different. to, sometimes you got to take two or three bites, get yeah. to coat your tongue with that taste, right. and then, then make a determination. So give it another bite or two. Okay, it's sweet. I do like the sweet. Um, it's very similar to a creme brulee, except it's cold instead of where a creme brulee is hot. So maybe that could be throwing you off too. Because you're expecting with that flavor for it to be hot. Maybe so. And it's not? It's not bad. It's definitely not bad. It's Try not it's not something I'm going, ooh, this is nasty, I'll never have it again. But it's, it's not just... something you're going, ooh, this is amazing, either. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It's good. I'll yeah. say it's good. It's not great, but it's good. Okay, so here's the menu. So we go to the salad bar first, which has all the side dishes. And then they'll start bringing us meat. These are all the different meats. So you have a card. And it starts out red because we have to go get our salad, but when we're ready for the meat, we turn it into green and they'll start bringing meat. But for right now, it stays red. Let's go get some salad bar. Okay, so here's the salad bar. With marinated green beans, tomatoes, and then we're getting into all of our salad fixings here, with different dressings, different types of lettuce. Uh, olive oils and vinegars and then all of our salad toppings here so many different toppings I don't even know what some of these things are there's olives roasted peppers um, just so many different things I don't even know what they are and on the other side we have serrano ham sliced chorizo manchango cheese mozzarella cheese, roasted jalapenos, parmesan, asparagus, sushi, which is kind of strange for a Brazilian restaurant, and couscous, salmon, shrimp salad, three bean salad, tabbouleh, roasted peppers, these are to die for. And then a thick potato salad and grilled provolone. Ooh, I missed that. So what did you get from the salad bar? I got some uh, some cheese and some pepperoni, some mozzarella, mozzarella balls. I got a little piece of sushi and some shrimp salad and some roasted peppers. Mm. Now I've got the roasted peppers and a three bean salad and some Manch Manchesco cheese. What yeah. was and then a salad. So that is chorizo 
croissant and cheese, and oh my god, that's good. And those roasted peppers are to die for. How, how's everything you've had so far? It's very good. Very good. Um, I'm ready for my meat. <laughs> Flip that's to green. But um, all this was just a warm up. Yep. All you gotta do is flip that card to green when you're ready. So this bread here, it's hot, very hot bread, and it's got cheese baked into it. It is unbelievably good. Mm. Thank you. Oh, that's good. A small piece, please. Oh, thank you. Mm. Okay, so he just brought the sides, and that's garlic mashed potatoes. Not very much of us. Nah, but there's just two of us. And um, sauteed mushroom. Garlic butter rice. Garlic and, butter and yuca rice. rice. And yuca. Never tried that. Never had yuca. Gotta try that. That's interesting. You can have the mushrooms, honey. Yeah, I know. Because I love you and I'm going to give you all the mushrooms. Because you love me? Yep, that's why. It has nothing to do with because you hate mushrooms? No. It's a whole, whole piece of filet. Mmm. Nice. Oh, Jason's been waiting very patiently for the filet mignon. Yeah. I got lamb first. That's yeah. going to make him happy. Bacon wrap filet. I know he'll take one of those. What about you? No, thank you. Oh, see, that's a happy man right there. He's got a regular filet mignon and then a bacon wrapped filet mignon. Looks like you like it. It's pretty pink. It's not raw like you like it. I can stand it. Okay, so we are here at La Bistro for dinner. If this taste as good as it looks okay so this is the seafood medley so it's shrimp and I can see either clams or mussels or something in there and scallops with a puff pastry and asparagus oh my god this looks fantastic and Jason got steamed mussels and they came in a pot with a lid muscle break that tendon that connects the muscle to the shell I've got jumbo shrimp here, which I'm Is that sure. Your oh, you, yeah, you show. That looks pretty. Very nice. Look at this. That's the medley. Seafood yes. Medley. So it's like have... a giant biscuit here. It looks... I know. That's what they call it puff pastry. Okay, so I'm gonna cut a piece of the puff pastry. Yeah. Dip it in that sauce. Okay. So I've got a bit of shrimp. Piece of the pastry. With a piece of puff pastry. Yeah, work, work your knife there, honey. Work that knife. There you go. Mm. That's tasty. That sauce is amazing. And you got some uh, mm. asparagus there, too? Asparagus, and let's see. I think this is a scallop. Is that a scallop, honey? I can't see it. That is, yeah, I think so, yeah. I think you okay. got my scallops. I didn't get any. I'm gonna ask him too. Mm. That's very tasty. This is a, this is a. Oh, amazing. that's a medley. So you oh got my God. Some this is a, he said this is their specialty for their appetizers to seafood medley. So this is the lump crab salad. So we're gonna have to cut into that. This is boiling hot. <laughs> And Jason's got the French onion soup. Do not touch it. Do not touch it. You just touched it and burnt your fingers. Well, I don't have any fingertips left because I've already burnt them, but I can feel the heat. 
Ooh. Use your knife. Your good knife. Oh, oh yeah. That's all. Let me get in there. Mm. So it, it looks like tuna from here, but it's it's what it is. It's it's like uh, it's just crab meat mixed up with stuff. Okay. Cream sauce. Whatnot. So let's give this a try. With a little bit of the sauce on it. Yeah. Mm. Okay, well, let's see what the. Try all these little look things around the plate. I did. That looks like There's grapefruit. So let's see what this is. I think they're supposed to uh, accentuate the orange. orange and whatnot. Orange, orange and grapefruit. So they're supposed to accentuate this, but. You may not like it. And what is that? That looks like a cabbage leaf around it. It does. Spinach leaf or something. But I'm just eating the, the crab salad. It's very tasty. Jason has, is a connoisseur of French onion soup. Yeah, oh my god, something. look at that cheese. I don't think this baby's got no cheese on it. Whoa! It's loaded with cheese, y'all. And inside, you know, it's got the onions, it's got that good onion broth, and it's got some uh, some bread, croutons that's been uh, soaking. 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 Very, very, oh man. Well, I tell you, that just warms the soul. Right now. Mm -hmm. So you've got a hot and I've got a cold dish. Holy macaroonies. Mm. That's some of the best. Uh, French onion soup. That's my classic burger. And your spaghetti bolognese. Sp spaghetti bolognese. <laughs> and your spaghetti. Yes. Alright. Ready? Yes. One, two, three. Oh. Voila. Mm. Alright, it's delicious. Wow, nice. Oh, thank so you. My, oh, I love how the plates Enjoy. say Le Bistro on them. So this is the veal cutlets. They cook it perfect for you. Oh my God, and look at that. Ooh. Anyway, look at these little potatoes. Looks like little scalloped potatoes that are just fantastic. Oh, I out. love that. Got a little, uh, looks like some zucchini. And on top of that is some watermelon. I don't know. Maybe a tomato? Yeah, tomato. tomato. And look, inside, oh, we yeah. have some bits in there. in there. So. Oh, yeah, this looks amazing. All right, hand me the camera. We can't wait to cut into this. I can, I can start off by telling you, look at this. See that how tender that. Oh my gosh. Look how, look how deep that meat pushes down. Wow. It's like, look, it's like a little fluffy pillow. Like a little fluffy pillow of meat. Now, a little bit of truth, cut into it. Sharp knife. Not used to that. That's like butter, huh? Uh, yeah. That's a Jason steak. Absolutely cooked perfect. Absolutely cooked perfect. Yeah. Let's take a bite. You know, someone told us that the steaks here are better than the steaks at Cagney. Dip it in this little bourbon sauce here. They got. That's what we're talking about. Yeah. When you go to a steakhouse, this is what you want. Okay, so I have the veal medallions. Move that out of the way. Oh, they're already cut for me. Look yeah. at that. Yeah, they're already they're medallions. Yeah. So we've got some sort of this is like a twice cooked potato in here. Oh, it's very flavorful. Is it? Mm -hmm. How's the, the sauce is amazing. The meat is very tender. Mm. What is this? Oh, it's a potato cake. Mm -hmm. Potato. Yeah. Potato cake. Yeah, you just said that. I was just so mm. into your. Just like a hash brown. Mm -hmm. Okay, dessert. So, like, seriously, this is dessert time, all right? Not gonna try and pronounce any of these except the creme brulee because that's what I'm getting. 
and the Napoleon. So I understand why a cheese plate is on the dessert menu. So I can have one bite. And you can get ice cream. Ace, I got his cheese. I got the Rockport cheese. Looks like blue cheese. I got the Munster cheese, which I eat this at home all the time. Yep. This looks like brie, but it's not. This is the goat cheese. Some faces with this cheese. Man, these cheeses are too too hardcore for me, I think. That is, that is not like any. All right, I'm gonna... I was smart and ordered creme brulee because this is a good dessert. So let's look. Yeah. Watch, watch, watch. Crack. Ooh. Perfect. Consistency there. Ooh, we gotta get a little really good crack. Mm. You make it look delicious, honey. Mm. Oh, don't act like it's good or anything. You know you want some more of that Munster cheese. That was nasty. Does that taste like Munster we get at home? No. I don't know. What to, I that think, was not Munster. I think, I think Homeboy was playing tricks on we me. We get Munster all the time. That was not Munster. That was disgusting. This, on the other hand, is delicious. If you can... And my favorite, pizza. It's gonna be really hard for me not to order pizza. That's my thing. That is totally my thing. Lots of good food, looks like. Yep. So they brought us this bread that looks like it's from heaven. And so they take, see the oven back there? So I know that the bread is baked somewhere else, but they put it in the oven and they heat it up and then they slice it and put it in the bread basket and bring it out to your table. And then it's this glorious, yummy, delicious bread that I love so very, very much. Wow, that is not like any caprese salad I've ever seen before. And oh my gosh, Jason, that looks right up your alley. Oh my god. So out, so out my alley, it's a strike. <laughs> so we got uh, some salami, we got some cheese, some artichoke hearts, we got some bruschetta, mushroom. Olives. Mm. You're so funny. Yeah. All you've eaten so far is an olive. Yeah. How's the meat? That was a mushroom. Oh, I'm sorry, a mushroom. That is super thin sliced salami. You eat my, she's a salami girl too. Nope, you eat it. No. We're a meat and cheese family. Good salami. Oh, that is good salami. And she sprinkled pepper on it. So you normally think of traditional, the you normally think of this thin sliced mozzarella laid out on the tomatoes. It's a little different take on it. It's very fresh cheese. Mm. You got a big ball of mozzarella. Look at that. Dip in the oil, the oh, tomatoes. Mm. Fresh. Very, very fresh. Very good. So neither one of us ordered pasta at this Italian restaurant, so they insisted on bringing us some pasta. <laughs> oh. Oh my gosh, once they grate that Parmesan on there, it smells amazing. All right, you try it first. We're doing this Lady in the Tramp style. We're sharing. So you do it, you put it on, I don't know. Yep, that's what the big spoon's for. Good pasta. Oh yeah, 
us. That's quite amazing. Are you happy, man? I am a happy man. Two nights of steak in a row. Yeah, baby. Can't get enough steak in my world. Mine is going to have to cool off for a second before I don't get third degree burns on the roof of my mouth. Very tender. Look. Oh. Nice fluffy little pillow. Of a fluffy little meat. pillow of meat. But, but, well, they do get these serrated butter so it's like. All right. Oh, it's pink on the middle. Yes. That looks like a Jason steak. Very good. Is it as good as the one last night? Nope. But it's, it's very good. It's very good. It's hard to beat last night's steak. That steak was crazy good, very huh? Good. This is good though. Okay, pizza nut that I am. I come to this amazing Italian restaurant and I order pizza. But you know what? It's what I like. And this looks like very good pizza. And I've let it cool off for a few minutes so it doesn't like completely like melt the roof of my mouth. But it's still hot. That's what pizza is supposed to taste like. It's and hot and it's fresh. It's hot. Watched it get yeah. prepared and cooked. And the marinara's got chunks of tomatoes in it, so that's cool. And then he sprinkled like oregano or some other kind of seasoning all over the top of it. <laughs> Yummy! It looks delicious. Yeah. Okay, here is the menu for tonight. Are you gonna get any wine? Yes, probably. I think I want some wine too. I want some wine. Classic entree. Mm -hmm. And then here's tonight's specials. Prime rib. That mozzarella and basil stuffed chicken breast sounds really good. And then they always have wine recommendations. Okay, so that's the butternut squash soup. And Jason has the mozzarella ravioli with a lobster sauce. That's delicious. That's delicious? Yep. Okay, this is a butternut squash or roasted butternut squash soup. Oh, it's thick. Mm. Yeah. That's good. Is it good? It's very good. Okay, so I have the mozzarella stuffed chicken, and it's got rice and broccoli. Jason has, what kind of steak is this? Which one? This one, I know what that one is. Uh, New York strip, New York with peppercorn strip. sauce. Oh. oh, yes, please. We have horseradish. Uh, right, right across here. Uh, and then more. <laughs> Beautiful, thank you very much. Please. <laughs> Would you like a little steak with your horseradish, Jason? Yeah, well, we're going to see who's boss here. Okay, so he's got the prime rib. Turn it around so I can see it. Okay, I just want to eat the thing already. Okay, prime rib, a ton of horseradish, and a New York shrimp. All right. Let's see if the prime rib is as good as you remember it. Because you had it on what, our first well, I night? You, I can already tell you, by the, judging by the looks of it, that it's going to be as fatty as I remember it. Oh, it, it, that's a fatty meat. That's a good fat, though. I love yeah. it. Yeah. Get a little bit of horseradish? Not too much. Like I just did. <laughs> prime rib. 
Okay, so this is a mozzarella stuffed chicken breast. Let's turn see. it over. Turn it turn it around so the camera can see what's in there. I'm about to as soon as I get it. You cut don't do open. as good of an unveil as I Oh I'm sorry. See the inside? Uh, it's got kind of, sort of you don't really see what it is, all the good ones. Uh, it's got it's got mozzarella in there. Basil and, and mozzarella. Take a bite. Let's see if it's good. It's I got wonder. a lot of basil. Ooh, a lot of basil. First, first. Not bad. I just gotta get used to the basil. Yeah. And here is the room service menu and the mini bar because there is an actual mini bar in here. So here's the cost of everything in the mini bar. Here's the room service menu. So there's continental breakfast here and there's no, no convenience charge on this one or there's the breakfast specials. And then here's the all day menu. And anything, you can get as much as you want. And there's one $7.95 convenience charge delivery fee. But I found this is the only way to get a sandwich. I haven't seen any other sandwiches. So I got a sandwich. Jason got roasted chicken. And you can even get dessert. So the room service has arrived, but Jason has fallen asleep. So I'm gonna see if I can wake him up. He got roasted chicken. And I got a turkey sandwich. And they brought me french fries. And a whole pitcher of water, which is really, really nice.